mommies and daddies, we welcome you to the Zembra International Conference yeah. of Holiness Revival Movement Worldwide. We pray the Lord bless you richly for coming in Jesus' name. Fine. Amen. Listen to our song and be blessed. Disappointed the devices of the crafty, so that their hand will not perform the antiprice. Ephesians chapter 6, 1 to 2. Children, obey your parents, for this is right. Honor your father and mother, for this is the first commandment to promise. 
John chapter 1 verse 1 to 2. In the beginning was the word, and the word was with God, and the word was God. The same was in the beginning with God. Matthew 7, 7. And she shall be given unto you. Seek and ye shall find. No can the door be opened unto you. John 17, 17. Sanctify them through thy truth. Thy word is truth. Jeremiah 33, verse 3. Call unto me, and I will answer thee, and I will show thee great and mighty things which thou knowest not. Second Samuel chapter 9, verse 7. And David said unto him, Fear not, for I will surely show thee kindness. For to my time thy father sick, and will restore the land of saw thy father, and thou shalt eat bread on thy table continuously. Psalm 121, verse 1 to 2. I will lift up my eyes unto the hills. From which cometh my help? My help cometh from the Lord, which may have not earth. Isaiah 49, 24 to 25. Shall the prey be taken away from the mighty? Nor the Lord will captive be delivered. But thus said the Lord, even the prey of the mighty shall be taken away, and the prey of the terrible shall be delivered. For I will contend with him that contend with thee, and I will save thy children. John 10, 30, I and my father are one. Exodus 14, 14, the Lord shall fight for thee, and ye shall hold thy peace. Thanks. My name is Ada Maizu Ejoy. I'm yet to tell you to be a vigilant mother. You are the woman of your house. Teach your children the way of the Lord. Be vigilant. Satan, Satan is ready to destroy homes. Be very, very vigilant. Some mothers of nowadays does not want to listen to their children all because they are busy on other matters. You are just a caretaker. The child in your hands is not yours. So you have to train them in the way of the Lord. Be like the women in Bible, like Sarah, Anna, Rebecca, and Deborah. So I'm here to challenge you to rise up as a mother in Israel and train up your child to glorify their heavenly father. Thank you. Good evening. Good evening, my mommies and daddies. My name is Hedra Yakubu Lonsha. I'm here to give you a word of advice. As you listen, may you be blessed. Dear parents, what kind of a child are you raising? What legacy are you giving your children? Are you teaching them the ways of the Lord? Did the internet dictate you how to raise a child? A child is a gift from God. Your responsibility as parents is to raise up that child right. Proverbs chapter 22 verse 6 says, Train up a child in the way he should go, and when he is old, he will not depart from it. Bring them to church at all times, and make sure they are not praying. Why messages and prayers are going on? My dear parents, raise up godly seed. Raise up a generation that will stand firm in faith. My dear parents, what do you need from God while raising that child? If you need money, he is your provider. If you need wisdom, he is the only wise God. If you need help, he is your helper. In times of weakness, he will be your strength. Even when family and friends forsake you, he will never leave you. My mommies and daddies, I challenge you today. Raise up godly seed. Raise up godly seed. Raise up generals for Christ. Raise up generals for Christ. Raise up warriors for Christ. Thank you. God bless you. My name is Daniel Peter. I'm from Suleja Zone. I'm here to say the Ten Commandments, which is taken from the book of Exodus chapter 20, verse 1 to 17. And it says, God spoke, and this were his word. I am the Lord your God. We brought thee out of the land of Egypt, where you were slaves. Worship no God but me. Do not make for yourself images in heaven, earth, in the water, under the earth. Do not bow down to any idol or worship it. For I, the Lord, I tolerate no rivals. I bring punishment to those who hate me on their descendants down from the third and fourth generation. But I show my love to thousands of generations of those who love and obey my laws. Do not use my name for evil purposes. For I, the Lord, will punish anyone who misuses my name. You, for you have six days in which to do your work. But on the seventh day is a day of rest dedicated unto me. 
On that day, no one is expected to walk, neither ye nor your children, nor your servants, nor the foreigners that live in your country. Honor thy father and mother, for this is the first commandment we promise. Do not kill, do not steal, do not commit adultery, do not be a false witness against thy neighbor, do not desire a man's house, do not desire his wife, do not desire his cattle, do not desire his sheep, do not desire anything else that he owns. Thanks. Good day, everyone. My name is Lois Maitu. I'm here to tell you who Jesus is through the entire Bible. In Genesis, Jesus Christ is the bread of life. In Exodus, he's our Passover lamb. In Leviticus, he's our high priest. In Numbers, he's the pillar of cloud by day and the pillar of fire by night. In Deuteronomy, he's the prophet like unto Moses. In Joshua, he's the captain of our salvation. In Judges, he's our judge and our giver. In Ruth, he's our king's man, redeemer. In First and Second Samuel, he's our trusted prophet. In King Saul Chronicles, he's our reigning king. In Ezra and Nehemiah, he's the rebuilder of broken down walls of my life. In Esther, he's our Mordecai. In Job, he's our ever living redeemer. In Psalms, he's our shepherd. In Proverbs and Ecclesiastes, he's our loving bridegroom. In Psalms of Solomon, he's our wisdom. In Isaiah, he's our prince of peace. In Jeremiah, he's our righteous branch. In Lamentation, he's our weeping prophet. In Ezekiel, he's our wonderful faced man. In Daniel, he's the fourth man in the foreign fullness. In Isaiah, he's the faithful man forever married to backsliders. In Joel, he's the baptizer of the Holy Ghost of fire. In Amos, he's the body bearer. In Obadiah, he's the mighty to save. In Jonah, he's the great foreign missionary. In Micah, he's the messenger of the beautiful feet. In Nahum, he's our strength and our shield. In Abaku, God is our evangelist. In Sahanaya, God is our savior. In Haggai, he's the restorer of God's lost heritage. In Zechariah, he's the fountain open up in the house of David for sin and uncleanliness. In Malachi, Jesus Christ, the Son of God, rising healing with his wings. In Matthew, Jesus Christ, the King of the Jews. In Mark, he's the servant. In Luke, he's the Son of Man, feeling what you feel. In John, he's the Son of God. In Acts, he's the Savior of the world. In Romans, he's the righteousness of God. In First Corinthians, he's the rock that follows Israel. In Second Corinthians, he's the triumphant one giving to victory. In Galatians, he's the liberty he sets you free. In Ephesians, he's the head of the church. In Philippians, he's our completeness. In First and Second Thessalonians, he's our hope. In First Timothy, he's our faith. In Second Timothy, he's our stability. In Philemon, he's our benefactor. In Hebrew, he's our profession. In First Peter, he's our example. In Second Peter, he's our purity. In First John, he's our life. In Second John, he's our pattern. In Third John, he's our motivation. In Jude, he's the foundation of our faith and the revelation. He is the coming king. He is the first and the last, the beginning and the end, the keeper of creation and the creation of all. He is the architect of the universe and manager of all time. He always was, he always is, he always will be unmoved, unchanged, undefeated, and never undone. He was bruised and brought healing. He was dead and his pain. He was dead and brought life. He was persecuted and brought freedom. He is alive, longevity and more. He is gentleness, kindness, goodness, powerful, and he rules our life. Thanks.
My name is Doc Hassan. I'm here to say my memory verse in Yoruba language. Efeso ori keje ese ogun asibe iro ori ele ori ipile awa apostoli awa oli Jesu Kristi pita ka eje okuta egun ile iwe juwa ni ori kere la ese kefa Jesu lo na ati otito ati ye ko se ni keni to le wa sodo baba lai se ni pe ese re thank you Good evening I'm here to say and the last prayer in Hausa Ubamu one day ke chicken summer, Kasarka ke sunanka, Murkin kashezo, Abunda kake so, Aisha chicken dunia, Kamayanda ake isha chicken summer, Kabamu rana tayo abinchi ini, Kagarfa famuna lefi fumu, Kamayanda muna garfa famu masulefi, Karaka kaimu chicken jaraba, Amaka chichamu de gamungu, Ama mulki, the ipo, the girma, na kane, harabadan, ame. I'm, I'm here to say the Lord's prayer. Good evening, parents. I'm here to say the Lord's prayer in Igbo language. Na ina neligwe otito dera hagi ochichi gibia kuche gime nuwa oto si eme neligwe bara eme ayi oto si bara ndu madu meha ya eri ayi tata ke ke eze gibia ta ne e baby amen. Good evening, mothers and fathers. I'm here to say Genesis 1 verse 1 in Ubudu language. In the beginning, Unima got Unima Dona Ukeboni, Sodaimbo Zali, Sodaimbo Umu, Sodaimbo Nashi in Boshi, Sodaimbo raise up Golly to Jankaba women. Good evening, beloved. I'm here to say my memory verse in Epic. John 3 16. Where John, he was the damn fang break. Kova basiaka mama eri bono mintum tutu anye si o ikwangi kwanga inesi eno mana woke ready eke poti dem yeye ekuta edi yeye nesi siwe so so thank you. Good evening, mommies and daddies. I'm here to say my memory verse in Tiv language. Psalm one one eight verse six to eleven. They take care of me. Hingi o wasemo. Na hamu nenga awashi mawa anshayo mba bukere mi shiongla. Te takia amo, mekura chiaka, kanyi joo wa ere me. Hemba don usu shate au veren shima shao. Hemba don usu shate au veren shima shama tare. Akura yochi kasem, kake iti ite ma ngbe akura ye. Akasem, ee akasem, kake iti ite ma ngbe akura ye. Proverbs chapter 3 verse 1 to 4. One one, it is in your middle of the world. It's in my own, it's one until I'm a kid. God, I'm going to say, why I'm going to say, my young man, I'm going to say, 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 Good evening, mommy and daddies. My name is Joy Samuel Longs. I'm here to say my memory verse in Tarot language. Galatians chapter 5, verse 25. I have put my ink into the shy ruru te. I'm a poor if you turn a chain to shy rupa. Thanks. Good evening, my parents. My name is Emmanuel Charles. And to, and to present 2 Corinthians 13 14 in French language. In la grâce de Seigneur Jesus Christ, la mort de Dieu et la communication de l'Esprit soit avec vous tous. Amen. Good day, my beloved mommies and daddies. I'm here to say Psalm 121 in Spanish. Atare mi sohos, arismondez, didomo bindra mi sokoro. Mi sokoro, yene de fetus, de itos, nesinos inadiedra. Nolala tope el fezvalari lu, li solombilan eri de kwadilo. 
they are key, Nasi and Sido, Ni Domino, and Kewalo, and I, Fesus, Eswalalo, Fesus, Asusumbla, Atomano, Deretan, Elson, Feta Feta Harrio, Ni Danula, the Notio, Feva, Dawalala, the Tono Manu, El Quadilo, to Halma, Feva, Quadala, to Sariba, Idendran, the Daura, Iparacientre. Thanks. Harma, 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 me solidness revival moment worldwide. Is God reviving his people in holiness, righteousness, and truth worldwide, moving with them to heaven? Listen to the voice of Jesus to Harma, saying, Repent and be converted. Thank you. Harma. Amen. Oh, my God. 